D2DNY Real World HVAC Simplified Today I got a service call on this MRI mobile mobile MRI CT scan unit and um, I'm going to give you an overview of the situation that we have here of this setup most of you may not have seen a setup like this before again this is a trailer Let's see it's a fully built trailer this is the entrance right here uh, this is what this is a uh, cat scan uh, cat scan see as for pets so they, if you want to do imaging for your pets that's what it is so here we have the, the um, helium refrigeration unit it says helium compressor and it is chirping away I don't know much about this particular unit it is a refrigeration unit uh, the refrigerant is helium and this refrigerant here uh, this evaporator uh, cools down the magnets in the MRI um, unit or MRI uh, scan machine here we have the chill water that is, that is attached to the chiller as you can see that is sweating all right so we got we got we have chill water the pump back there all right all the stuff all the stuff so basically the chiller is cryo cryogenics or cryo cooling the chiller, the chill water from the chiller cools down the condensing unit in this helium compressor, compressor unit. So once again, the chill, the chill water from the chiller cools down the condenser in this unit. This evaporator, the helium, is then uh, used to cool down the magnets on the MRI machine. So this is that section of it. I'm going to go around and show you the actual chiller okay so here we are on the other side of the chiller oh not the chiller but the trailer <laughs> all right and these right here are your cooling units these are the condensing sections or the chiller section of the of, of this whole thing uh, set up and there is there is a full trailer all right so let me get up in there so there you go I have the panels open, or the inch panel. You lift them up. Got a little latch right here. Latch it in so you can get under. And you can hear the condenser fan blowing away. Okay. There is your compressor, condenser coil. And this is in fact a chiller so you know you're going to have a chill water barrel for your evaporator somewhere in the back so just to give you an overview of what it looks like all right so in order to get access or service of these equipments you're going to have to that Okay. If you just wanted to check, check pressures, you could easily access it from here. Okay, this is your discharge service valve uh, port right there. And uh, this is your suction service port down here. You can attach your gauges, stuff like that. But if you want to go further and deeper, you have to remove these little brackets, lift them up, and then pull. Pull this whole thing out. okay so there you go clearly now you can see your compressor your condenser coil and behind this panel here is your uh, controls but this unit is working fine this chiller is working fine i got it's sweating over here compressors is running i didn't put my gauges on it as yet but i think it's 
it's going to be fine. There's no issues here. Just an overview so you, so you guys could see. If you haven't seen something like this before, you have the knowledge. You know it exists. Here you have your chill, uh, chill water barrel. It's a chill water barrel or your evaporator. This is a chiller. It has everything a regular system would have. Actually, this right here is actually more of a storage tank. Here is your evaporator right there. And you can pull this out some more, but it's actually sliding back in uh, based on its gravity. I don't know if it latches, but... Alright, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. I do upload videos like this on a weekly basis. Again, this is D2D NY Real World HVAC Simplified. Real time. You won't find this anywhere, anywhere else but here.